got here? You just like to chill here now? Huh? Behind the mirror? I like how you discover new spots every day and freak me out because I thought you ran away. Over the weekend, I got cold, so I basically did nothing. Well, I could barely open my eyes because my headache was just so bad. But here I am. The only update was that last Thursday, this came in the mail. Hey, no. when they come, okay? So just go up into the other room. That's good. That's all? Okay, thank you so much. It looks bigger in this space than I envisioned it, which is why I'm so glad that it's see-through, so it's not so obstructive. Finally today, I'm feeling way better. The only symptom I have is like, I went to take a COVID test this morning just to be sure, and I should have results in a couple of days. I've been meaning to watch The Girl with the Dragon Tattoo for a while, although it might not be the smartest thing to relax to before bed. Yeah, definitely not a nice thing to wash before bed. But that's all right, I got up early this morning, my hair's all clean, the dishes are done, and these days I kind of have tiny meals like a bunch of times throughout the day. So just a quick toast to start the morning. You know, a quick note about the movie from last night again. I'm really sad about what happened to the cat. I basically lived off of takeout when I had that cold. And I have some Indian leftovers here that I'm just scrambling some just egg with for my next tiny meal. And it wasn't so bad. It was all right. Finally caught up on some orders. One snack. I'm on the computer a lot because a bulk of what I do, I spend my life on the internet. So I want to introduce the sponsor of this video, which is Identity. They're a tool to declutter your browsers for as long as I can remember. I am always the person with a thousand tabs open, like the maximum allowed. So Identity is a tool that's on the internet. You have a command center where you can add all of your most frequented sites. Sometimes I need to go to my channel and edit a video or upload something, but as soon as I get to the homepage, YouTube is designed to lure you into watching the recommended or like a husky in a bathtub. I need to see that. Can't remember what I was even doing in the first place. So I want to show you my command center. If you use a shared computer or need to step away from your computer with people around you, you have to enter the master password in order to access everything here. So I have on dark mode. It normally looks like this when you first sign up. My eyes are more sensitive. It's way easier on the eyes if I turn on dark mode. So I really like this. To add a new tile, they already have some built-in sites. Say you visit a different site very often. I'm just going to throw in one. My shop URL, I'm going to copy and paste that into this and name it PB shop since there's not going to be the logo I will search it generating it currently and it'll be like use this logo the dimension is not really great for that and I will literally screenshot something like this upload my logo by clicking on this so I set my tag to shopping whenever I look that up you'll see a bunch of sites same thing with patreon which is another thing I do I have the home page and the messaging another time-saving function is to input usernames and passwords for any of these given sites with accounts and clicking the tile anywhere will launch the website as well as in the background have the login info copy and pasted so you can just go right in so you see I have my work email info here and the other sites I haven't yet added anything and when you don't it just looks blank and you see a dash you'll find all of the tags listed along the left here for example bills I also have a travel column I try to learn French in my free time I type that in and for example Google Translate I make sure to have the URL customized to already be set at English and French and you see they're all laid out alphabetically but prioritize them by favoriting the sites. Netflix, pretty much like every time I eat dinner. One additional function that's available is the notes and list column to quickly access my briefs. The key idea here is to simplify this space. Don't get distracted or waste your time or lose track of things. Once it's organized all here, you can spend your time with more attention on what you actually want to work on, use more intention on a daily level when you're carrying out your tasks. 
And yeah, I hope I can be a lot more productive and less distracted in this way. Thanks so much again to Identity for sponsoring this video. I hope that you're interested in trying them out. My sign up link is right there in the description box so you can get started and see how you like it. The next meal is two spring rolls that I made and I wrapped some fake meat in there. I spent way too long on this really dumb transition because I kept messing up. So it just got me so stressed. I feel really tense. I'm gonna go out for a walk and hopefully the allergies won't be crazy. It's 60 degrees, so it's very nice out. And I think this is what I need to calm. I'm wearing a tank top because it was an odd 80 degrees this afternoon. And look, I got this nice guest bed all set up again. This is where all of my guests will stay, including my sister tonight. Bambi and Prairie have been messing around. I put a chocolate on the pillow, okay? This is Hotel Piper. This is the temporary setup. I hope that it looks cuter in the future as I get better sheets for me guests. There is nothing like the thrill of cleaning up because you have to. You know, you've been busy working or maybe you're procrastinating, but I mean, clean up right before someone shows up. It's not by any means the goal tidiness. Happy news, I finished the vlog finally. I worked really hard on it all day again and I'm super proud of it. Okay, we're ready to go. Yay, borrowing her jacket. Why are you so much taller? Because my heels are four inches. Since Lilith is working at a jewelry company now, she's more well versed and just learning more and more about that world in general. So we spent the day kind of window shopping, looking at a lot of designer jewelry for fun. But the main reason we were down there is because I wanted to get her opinion on this silly necklace that I placed an order for. So it'll be coming in maybe in a couple of weeks. And my sister's favorite designer is Simone Rocha right now. It was really cool seeing this shot because they're doing a collection inspired and in collaboration with Louise Bourgeois artwork and she didn't get anything but they did gift her free prints from one of their seasons and that was really awesome and I also told her about this denim company that I discovered and I really like because they're high quality and emphasize on the construction of the textile as well as their sourcing and they're made in Canada so more on that in the future too had dinner with Eugene and Chris and I was so fun I haven't seen them in two years it just feels really good to be back together with friends. I didn't vlog the next day, but we got brunch and just kind of chilled. It was very rainy and just like that, she went home. Well, I'm off to bed. You guys enjoy the big futon while you can. You look comfy. Are you comfy, mister? Good night. Fifty pounds, fifty pounds. But the what do you call it, the box 
dimensions made it easy enough to flip over. Oh my god, I'm covered in sweat, so I'm gonna uh, finish my orders and then think about assembling this tonight or tomorrow. Why not, right? First step is to finally sew the strips onto the backings of my wall hangings. This is the last of my pre-order batch. Thank you so much for my amazing, patient, and understanding customers. These are made with much love, and I hope that you guys love them. Starting to slowly collect essentials for the house. I'm gonna reuse this box to mail out something because last week I had a fundraiser going on and I chose the winner last Friday. I ordered a couple of cutting boards called the Reboard because I gave mine to my sister. I have just been very carefully using my big plate or cutting stuff in midair. Just make and do. Thank you to everybody who is participating to raise money to support the AAPI community. And I'm about to ship this off to a lovely person in Canada. Got a lot of goodies. Let's just do a very quick haul. Pimple. Onions. Fiber bars. Tends to go a little overboard every time I prepare this stew, but I'll have leftovers again. Appetizer, decided to treat myself to this. And some, what is this? Tangerine LaCroix. Never mind. Oh my god, I don't think I've ever consumed that much liquid. I need to go lay down. Let it flow, let gravity do its job. Oh, oh. <sighs> I need a burp. Bambi's looking at me very concerned. I'm okay. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Are you a happy girl? Are you a happy girl? We ended up cuddling and falling asleep. Woke up at 10 something to brush my teeth just now. It is time to put together the cabinets. I hope it doesn't take longer than three hours. The review said it was sort of difficult to do it, especially alone. Okay, thank you for your help. It's sort of a budget furniture, but for the space and the depth of my bedroom, it was really hard for me to find the right cabinet or the kind of dresser that wouldn't block so much of the space. Together, I think I spent like $300 for these two, a little more than that. It looks really cute, so even though it's not the best quality, I'm hoping I can keep it for a long time. about this piece of furniture is the silver hinges and the door I really hate. <laughs> I just didn't want to compromise on that one little detail. So I thought why not, I'm gonna change it to gold tone. I love warm tones.
is going great, or so I thought, okay, until literally now. This is when it gets difficult, and now I know what people are talking about because the screw holes on the doors are impossible. Like my screwdriver got messed up. I had to end up using really weird tools, and it was also the sheer quantity because I had to do five screws to attach onto the door and then four per door to attach to the cabinet and it was so tiring. I barely had the muscles to get it done and it just makes me sad because I have to do it twice. say that stupid piece of furniture really conquered me because I only took an hour or so to put together the whole thing as soon as I get to the doors it takes two hours so three hours in total and I'm determined to go faster the second time which is why I'm carb loading <sighs> also because I have my first fitness class tomorrow <laughs> I'm gonna get some hmm it's been like 10 minutes but really I get here with no effort and I'm just dreading all of the tiny screws that make me feel like my thumb's gonna fall off. <sighs> it is a little past midnight and I want to say I have one door left. All right, so this is what I've got so far and I'm going to organize, clean up, and just really start settling in from now on. Thank you so much for joining me, and I'll see you soon. Take care. <laughs>